Tiger Lily Squad. <laughs> Every time I talk to y'all, I get hecka excited. What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's hey? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's hey? Tiger Lily Squad gang, gang. How you living? How you breathing? How you feeling? What's poppin'? What's <laughs> How you doing? How you living? How you breathing? How you feeling? <laughs> Whoa! Hold on, hold on. This is green tea with um honey and cinnamon. The cinnamon look crazy in there, but cinnamon cinnamon is good for your gut, your complexion, all kind of stuff. So, I've been drinking it in almost everything, um, including like sea moss and stuff. But um, before we get into this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on all your post notification bells. Follow me on all social media platforms at Essence of Shay. I feel like I took a break from Instagram by the time y'all see this, but I've been consistent on YouTube. I just needed a break. Like, I needed a break. And um, while taking a break, I came up with this. But like, comment, subscribe. Let's get right into the video. So how y'all doing? We are rearing closer to the end. Closer to the end of this really interesting year, bro. This year has been very very up and down for me like low-key i had some high moments and i had some really low moments um sometimes where i don't know like how i'm gonna pay my rent um what i'm gonna eat uh how, i'm just keeping a buck with you how i'm gonna get some tampons or pads for my menstrual like but i also had high moments where i made like crazy amount of money on my business a couple months and like I met some amazing people and reconnected with some folks and just you know just it was just a real legit roller coaster and usually in life is like that but somehow this year for real and like my nut my life number is four and that's like hard work and a whole bunch of other things and when I say <laughs> like strength and all that say when I say that 2020 has literally been that for me yo and then it adds up to a four so i legit like oh this is my year this is my life no sis is not but in this video i wanted to talk about how my locks had helped me to tap into my divine feminine energy so i haven't pulled up what the divine feminine energy is and i'm gonna read it to you it says she is the energy of beingness powerful loving and caring she allows to trust have faith patiently observing by leaning back the divine feminine is one that finds her path from the inside out through love and feels freedom from within. So before I started my log journey, like I had a lot of personal issues going on, like as far as like father issues, family problems, I acted out, like I stole, I lied. I, I just did a bunch of stuff that's just not in the character of me. And I knew something was going on, but I just didn't, like, my my masculine energy was taken over, which is the strength and just, like, throw things to the side and do, like, for the majority of my life, that's what it was, right? Um, but when I started my lock journey, I remember sitting down thinking, like, yo, I don't know what is going on, but I feel as though like people, people just are attracted to me more. And I feel like that's when it started. You feel what I'm saying? Like folks was just like, 
gassing me up and I got more attention from guys than I did before. I always used to be like the home girl, but now people actually want to take me on dates. So that helped boost up my, my self-esteem. But then as I my my locks like the two, three year mark, I started to like work on myself, like actually take the time to think about what was bothering me and like be more nurturing not only to myself but to others and um it was just a matter it just it was just different bro and that's what I always tell about people when 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 I say embrace your lock journey embrace it it's more than just hair and a lot of people now they're just growing their locks because of they just the locks are just popular right now just let's keep it real locks are popular right now so everybody wants locks um and that's cool but if you are um the lucky ones i would say that will take the time and like actually let that let that um change you from the inside out yo you are forced to be reckoned with so when I started my locks and up till now is when I started to actually and I used and I took it more than just my hair like took it just more than just hairstyle or I can make money from doing this like I started to meditate um my intuitions just got like really stronger um I started to tap into like crystal work and like and also my self-care game listen yo <laughs> the thing about the divine feminine energy it caters to you the whole point about it is to just make you number one and take care of you in whatever facet that makes you happy for me that's working out that's cooking um sometimes that's just like putting on some just a little bit of makeup just to make myself feel just a little bit better is not for like I guess it will be for vanity I guess but it just is all about just making yourself number one and not seeking happiness or validation from other people you know what I'm saying um and it's all about this, this tapping into your emotions a lot of people run from their feelings for, about things and the divine when you tap into your feminine energy um it's all about nurturing and taking care of and like just loving and just the energy and just flowing and doing all kind of stuff and people use that in a sexual way um they use it in it, it just depends and there's no wrong way to do it as long as you're not hurting someone i'm gonna put that disclaimer out there but my locks have made me in a sense more girly because i used to be a hardcore tomboy like you would not catch me dead like in some heels or a skirt like you like at a graduation or probably church or something but other than that uh-uh 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 this is what you'll see 24 7 but i do say that my locks kind of like shifted my pl like where i was meant to be going does that make sense like i'm still shay i still like to wear sneakers i still like to wear sweats like i still like to be comfortable but i have no problem switching it up now and i don't feel like i'm doing it for somebody else but i'm doing it for me because i feel sexy in sweats but I feel sexy too in heels. You know what I'm saying? Does it make sense? Or I'm just talking all over the place. How you could incorporate or um, tap into your divine feminine energy. I would say do a self-care routine. You know like how you sit down and you go in the shower and you washing your face and you're brushing your teeth and you do everything be intentional about it you know what i mean take that time don't rush it like take even if you have to do it at night because that's a more that's a time where you could set more time aside as opposed to in the morning because you might be like in a rush wherever it is like like take that time when you're in the shower just shower and just like because water is like cleansing you know what i mean so 
just go in the shower and just like have the intention that th this water is just going to cleanse away all the negative, all the self-doubt, all the lack mindset, whatever it is, just take that and just wash yourself and just be very intentional. Like don't rush through it. Just take care of yourself. You know what I mean? Um, and just rinse yourself off. And while it's like d the dirt or whatever is going down the drain, just envision that as like, yo, the day that I had today, um, it's gone, it's done with. The arguments that I may have had, it's done with. I release it. I accept that it happened, but I'm I, I release it now. Um, what did I learn? From, you just, you know what I'm saying? Just, just be intentional with your stuff. Don't rush through your self-care. Another way that you could just tap into that is like when I do um, my my hair my facial routine i put on some music that makes me feel like mm, you know what i'm saying like <laughs> like sizza oshun janae some some beyonce uh sometimes it'd be like some because i i love egyptian culture i just love the gold and the ambi i just love it the just the richness you know what i'm saying so um i sometimes put on egyptian music while i'm doing my washing my face and brushing my teeth um i'm saying intentions in my head just boosting myself up and feeling myself you know not literally i mean you could do that i mean <laughs> i ain't trying to tell you girl i ain't trying to tell you, you can't do it nah do your thing nah you know what I mean? but, whatever you know what i'm saying tap into it another thing i want to touch on is like the feminine energy like i said in the beginning is making yourself happy like doing what's best for you you know what i'm saying like if you want to go out there and buy that dress and it makes you feel good if you want to go to dinner and you just want to sit down and just have a nice glass of wine but you don't want to you tired of waiting for others to do these things like go out and do it it's all about making yourself the number one priority making yourself happy um having that time to just journal my stomach growling having that time to journal and write down your emotions and learning from it and just ultimately making you a better you and not being all the strong enforcer all the time that women are are told that we have to be because some men can't handle their business but you know what I'm i ain't gonna get into that now nah. <laughs> but just you know what i'm saying like but this it all came from legit my locks. So when I tell y'all, like, it's more than just my hair, bro. Like, it's more than just a, a hairstyle for me, bro. Like, my locks has literally transformed my life to a better me. Like, and the same thing could happen to you if you tap into it. Um, and on a spiritual end and it is not just another hairstyle that you have but you don't have to and nobody's judging you for it um but yeah if you guys enjoyed this video uh don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you already tap into your divine feminine energy sis Um, leave it in the comment box below. Tell me how you do it, what you do. Um, if you haven't and you are going to start now, let me know in the comment box below. Um, uh, don't forget to share this video because a lot of people will be missing what locks can do for you, fam. It's not just a hairstyle, it's a lifestyle. Uh, anyways, I love you guys so much for watching. See you later, Tiger Lilies. Crash course, let me hide the money in the dashboard. Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the Porsche? Goofy with the